Greco, I'm sure that's not the way you obviously wanted this game to end. Do you still take away from some of the positive things, like Winder settling down, um, or Winder settling down Walner's day, the bottom of the order? Yeah. Overall, it was a good homestand. I, I liked the way we played. Um, I liked the way we competed in that, you know, in that game today. I, I did. Um, we didn't win. We did. We came up short. There are some things we can definitely do better going forward, but uh, there are some things we did that were really, really nice. And the way that we uh, continued to have good at bats as the game went on, um, you said at Walner's, you know, he's whacking the ball all over the place. Um, overall, just a very competitive, you know, effort with a lot of fight uh, from our team. And um, we somehow we're sitting there. A swing away from uh, winning the ball game mm -hmm. after all of that and that's it's almost hard to believe um, that that's the case but we put ourselves in, in a good position uh, and there was never any quit in, in anybody out there so um, that's all we can do because these games are not going to all go smoothly we're not going to run away with every game that's not a reality um, but we're putting ourselves in position almost every game to get a win. Joe Ryan found himself with two straight counts a lot of times and lost those battles, unfortunately. How would you sum up what you saw from him today in a shorter outing? That was a long outing. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't know how many uh, innings or outs Joe ended up going, but he had to work very hard. He, there were a ton of foul balls. Um, he had to throw a lot of pitches. Uh, it, it, uh, it, you know, it, it never felt like anything was easy it just it was all hard and um, that happens I mean uh, it's not like he was out there walking everybody and that's why his pitch count was high I don't how many walks did he have I don't, I don't know how many walks he ended up two. with two walks I mean it's not walks it's just um, you know finishing at bats and uh, uh, he had to work very hard that's why I mean he was he threw a lot of pitches that last inning and uh, uh, we just had to get him out of there I mean that was just too much but um, you know we'll uh, We'll be fine. Joe will be fine. He's going to work through uh, everything that he's working through, and I have complete faith in, in Joe Ryan and the way uh, that he can go out there and miss bats and get outs. And um, he's going to he's going to kind of uh, swing upward from where he's at right now. That's the way I feel about it. Um, and 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 learn something from from an outing like this for sure. How encouraging is just the the crooked numbers that the lineup continues to put up? We're scoring runs. We're having good at bats. We're driving the ball. Um, we're finding different ways to score. You know, we're playing good, kind of smaller baseball at certain points uh, of the game when we need to. But um, uh, there were just a lot of good, good adjustments made at the plate today by our hitters, and it's been like that really since we came back from the All Star break. So if we continue to uh, to do this offensively, um, I know I'm going to be happy, and and I think we're going to be uh, uh, in a great position at that point. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do you have an update on Joey? Um, Joey had to come out of the game with heat-related illness. Um, I, we saw him after he hit the, was it a double that he hit down there? And we looked up and he did not look great. He almost didn't take a lead on the first pitch or two. Um, so you know there's something going on. He was probably trying, I thought he was just trying to catch his breath for a second. And it was, a, it was more than that, I think. Uh, uh, you see on days like this, occasionally guys, their bodies just kind of, um, you know, succumb to the to the to the heat, and uh, there's no way to know when it's going to happen. It, it just uh, it hit him hard, is what it did. So I'm glad he stayed on his feet when he when he scored um, and came around, but uh, he wasn't going to stay in the game that much longer. And our trainer said we had to take him out. So that's that happens. He's getting an IV. He's, I think he's going to be okay. You see anything different from Belazovic? Just been so good against righties this year, and yeah, had a tough time with righties today. I think, I think he's probably fine. I, 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 I he gave up the homer on a fastball. I don't know where the pitch was, but um, two strike fastball, and he got popped. And uh, I think that happens. I think um, you know. I don't. I don't sit up here and question, you know, a lot of pitch selection and things like that. But uh, if you do throw, you know, fastballs with two strikes somewhere in the middle of the plate, they're going to get hit. 
and uh, doesn't mean they're going to be hit homers or, or hits or, or runs are going to come across, but you run the risk that balls are going to be put in play. And um, I think he's probably just fine and, and would probably just want that pitch back, both pitch selection-wise and, and the placement of the pitch. And if he gets them, I think we're probably sitting here, you know, happy and pleased with the, you know, or at least content with the way he threw the ball.